Good morning, guys. It is what day is it? Wednesday, the 18th. I'll put it on the screen, of course. It is 6:43. I did not sleep last night. I went to bed around 11 or 12. Oh man, I'm all out of lotion. Come on, give me some more. Um, note to self: put a new lotion in your pocketbook because you're out <laughs> but yeah i didn't sleep too i didn't sleep at all pretty much last night um i was up with my mom and my sister then i went to bed slept for a couple hours my stomach was hurting me so i got up and then i've been up ever since so i was going to try to take a little hour nap because my plan was to head out to costco this morning to grab some stuff from there um, because everything is about to start shutting down again. So what I'm going to do is, since I can't get up, I'm going to go to Walmart, see if I can find anything there. Then after I go to Walmart, go to Target, and then go to Costco. So Walmart open at seven. Um, Target does early admissions between eight and nine. Any for anybody who have any health ailments, seniors and prego and prego people and people who are pregnant. So I fall into that category. Um, cause I have a few health ailments and then Costco does the same thing. They typically open at 10, but at nine, they open up for people who are seniors or who have, who have health ailments. So hopefully I can show my doctor's note and that'll be all good to go. But yeah, guys, I'm going to go ahead and head out to Walmart. Hopefully I can get there within 15 minutes or so before everybody gets there. Cause I'm sure many people are thinking the same thing that I'm thinking, like, let's go out and get some stuff now because people are literally taking stuff off the racks like they did before and we needed toilet paper and paper towels so i'm like let me just go ahead and go out and see if i can find some lights all too so we'll be good for the next couple months you know because i don't know what's about to happen so yeah let me stop talking i'm gonna go ahead and hit there and then if i can i will sh try to film it while i'm in there okay all right <laughs> wish me luck guys I'm here at Walmart hopefully you can hear me but I'm here at Walmart it's a line I think only because it's just opening at m at 7 it's a slight line but I think it's just because they're opening up at 7 and I just got here at 7 so I'm about to run in here Guys, I'm back in the car. I made, I was successful. I got some micro bin, some Lysol wipes, some, they only had four packs of toilet paper. They didn't have no paper towels. And I got, I found one last bottle of alcohol. So now I'm headed to Target. I'm about 20 minutes away from there. Hopefully I have success, hopefully I'll have success going in there because, um, Hopefully with my doctors know. I need to find it and pull that up real quick. As a matter of fact, let me do that now. But I will see you guys when I get to Target. A few people walk into Target. I'm not sure if it's open, but I'm about to go in there and see what they have. And I have my doctor's note, so hopefully they won't check me out. I'm gonna tell them I have health ailments and I can show my doctor's note. So let me just go in here right now.
right guys so back in the car i made out at target they didn't have no toilet paper and it's eight o'clock they open at seven now because it's a holiday hour so but the lady said she don't know how long that's going to be for because um it's a possible shutdown soon so i'm glad i did come out early so i was able to get in and out they did have lysol spray and lysol or clorox wipes and plenty of like the store brand wipes but i just went ahead and got um one of each in here so i can be you know respectful for others or respectful to others even though they really wasn't checking they wasn't checking in walmart so i was able to get two micro bands and two lysol wipes in there um especially because my mom she do work primarily from home mm -hmm. primarily from home but when she goes to work she likes to sanitize her stuff so yeah i made sure i got some so she could take some to work even though she they usually order stuff but either way i got that all taken care of but um yeah they had lysol wipes they didn't have no toilet paper like i said it was completely out of toilet paper so that's one thing but that's okay because I'm going to go into Costco and look for toilet paper. It is 8.05. They open at 9. So I guess I'm just going to be sitting out here in the parking lot for the next hour <laughs> at Costco. I think this is my turn. Yes, it is. Yeah, I guess I'm just going to be sitting out here at Costco for an hour until they wait, walk, until they open. Unless I see somebody walking up to, what is it called? Unless I see somebody walking up to the door, then I'll go in. Maybe they're having holiday hours too. I don't know, but even on the Target website. Actually, if you Googled Target, this location, it did say 7. But then when I went to the website, it said 8. But the lady did indeed say that they are opening up at 7 now because of the holiday. So... This is crazy. I never, every day, or like at least once a week now, I be having these thoughts. Like, I just really, I just really can't believe that this is how we are living life right now. Like, like nine months ago, everything was, I mean, what we thought was okay. <laughs> In actuality, it really wasn't. We were just told it was okay, but man it's just crazy how like in a year things could change so drastically you know but that's okay i'm still here by the grace of god i'm so blessed to be able to still continue to provide for myself and for my family as of now and you know god will always make a way i'm just trying to learn how to not stress over some things because at the end of the day i can't control everything i really can't like i can't control everything and for the most part things are out of my hands um i can do my best to try to control the things that i can control i'm trying to see if these places open i just pulled up to costco no they definitely look like they're closed yeah the doors aren't open and i don't need any gas i think i'm gonna park like right here so i can see when they open and get in and out Yeah, guys i'm just trying to learn how to just give things to the lord and not worry about things so much hopefully you guys were able to hear any of that let me repeat all that again just in case if, if you couldn't hear me because i had my heat on i'm waiting for costco to open i'm not going to sit on here for an hour though i got it's 809 they open up at nine o'clock for those who have ailments and such so i'm gonna do that at nine o'clock and no one's out here it is cars out here but i'm pretty sure that's probably the workers it's like 
another car. I'm, I'm expecting by 8.45, this is gonna be filled up, at least for the seniors. Um, and I'm gonna show my doctor's note and I'm just gonna act like I came in here before with it. He's like, oh, I'll come in here all the time, like once a month with my doctor's note and never been an issue. And if they tell me it's an issue today, then I'll tell them and I just come in today. And the next time I'll just wait till 10 o'clock. No big deal. But I'm glad I came out early. It was meant for me to not go to sleep <laughs> and come out early and get this done. Oh, I'm so tired. I have a headache. But I think I'm going to go ahead and go to the meat market after Costco. I think after this, I'm just going to shoot to the meat market and grab whatever meat we need. We need turkey wings and stuff. I think I'm going to grab some chicken wings and possibly salmon out of here. So I can do my market shopping for December as well. Um, so we'll see. Yeah, maybe I'll grab like three packs of chicken wings. Those chicken wings came in handy. And then... What else? Yeah, I think that's it. A few packs of chicken wings, some salmon. I came in here for one thing. Oh, toilet paper. I'm going to shoot straight to toilet paper. Hopefully they have. I saw at other um, Costco, they've been having pallets of Lysol spray. So hopefully I'm able to find that. Hopefully they have it. I don't even know if they have it. Hopefully they do. And then... I don't need really too much any anything else. I may get that olive oil from here. I'm not going to get the carry gold because it was on sale on this Friday, but I decided to just go ahead and come out today because my friend told me that they started clearing out the markets and stuff. So, and there's not that much stuff I need to get for Thanksgiving. Um, we might go tonight. We might go market shopping tonight instead of waiting until later this week so we can get it out of the way <sighs> and yeah guys i'm just hoping i'm successful in here hopefully they let me in because i do not feel like waiting two hours to get in here like no hopefully that's not the case but i think i'm going to call my boyfriend see if he's up and wait till them to open and when they open i will let you guys know i'll try to record but they a little they people be watching they really be stickler sometimes of you recording in here so if, if it's possible i'll record if not then i will see you when i get back in the car all right <laughs> guys i made out like a freaking bandit in costco so i got here at eight o'clock or 805 and they opened up at nine for seniors and those who have health issues so they don't really check anything you just walk in they kind of yell like 60 plus but i was i had my note out but they still let me in so i went in went straight to the toilet paper paper towel they had plenty of it and they had that pallet of lysol i said and they had that pallet of lysol so i just got one pallet i mean one pallet i got one case and it had four cans in there so we should be good to go also got toilet paper and more paper towels what else did I get? Um, what else did I get? What else did I get? Then I got food. Chicken, pie pies, water, three cases of water, all types of stuff. So I might try to do a quick, I probably won't do a grocery haul because it's just too much going on. I might though. We'll see how I feel when I get home because I'm like starving and my back is killing me. And then after I get home and unpack all this stuff, I'm going to go to the meat market and finish shopping for Thanksgiving. And then we should be good to go. But let me go ahead and get home because it's about to start getting more crowded in here. Even the guy when I left, he was like, oh, you made out like a bandit. You made out so good. I was like, yeah, I know. In and out. In and out under an hour. So that was amazing. The lines went by fast. It was amazing. Like, I'm just so blessed to be able to get here, get here safely, get all this stuff for my family. I'm just beyond blessed. So I spent a little more than I wanted to anticipate it on spending. But I think of it this way. I won't be coming out next month. To buy anything other than like i said like my odds and ends which is usually just stuff for salads and stuff for smoothies and that's probably about 20 dollars a week so if that maybe 15 between 10 and 15 dollars a week so i'm gonna go home unpack all this stuff i'm gonna try to show you if i can if not then maybe i'll just breeze over it but i got a good amount of stuff and i'm so happy so i don't know if you can see i'm just stacked up back there but on my way home, I will see y'all when I get there.
right guys so i'm back in the car it's 1201 i'm about to head to the meat market i came home unpacked sanitized everything everything just laying out other than the food items i put that up and then my mom usually is the one that put all like the toiletries and stuff up so i'm leaving that for her to do um and i just sat around for about 45 minutes or so so now i'm about to head back out to the meat market um I may go to the regular supermarket right after just to grab some stuff. Um, it just depends on how I feel because I haven't ate anything yet either. But it depends on how my energy up because I kind of just want to go ahead and get everything we need for Thanksgiving as well and not wait till Friday because I feel like Friday is going to be hell. My sister has to go back to the market to grab, um, what does she got to do? Her macaroni and cheese stuff. So, yeah, she may do th that on Friday, but for now, I'm about to just go to the meat market, possibly the market. I tried to show you guys what I got from Costco, but my mom's working and she was in a meeting, so I couldn't really talk. But long story short, that's what I got food items wise. And I also got, um, like I said, from Walmart. Costco and Target, I was, able, I was to able to get toilet paper from Costco and paper towels and the Lysol spray in the four pack. I was able to get one thing of Lysol spray and wipes from Target as well as paper towels. And from Walmart, I was able to get microband, one thing of Clorox wipes or, my, or Lysol wipes, one of the two. And they just had the four packs of Scott's paper towels. I mean, Scott's toilet paper, and that's what we use. And they had one thing of um one thing of alcohol left. So I made out good. I spent a lot more than what I anticipated on spending this month, but that's okay because I shouldn't need to buy anything for January. Not January. Until January. Um so yeah. I am gonna head to this market real quick and hopefully I can get whatever I need and then head back home. So I'll see you when I get back.